Thanks for tuning in. Today we're going to be reviewing the Lizard Skin Handlebar Grip. Handlebar grips are one of the main contact points between you and your bike, which is why they're such a great upgrade. Lizard Skin offers a variety of handlebar grips to choose from, whether you do mountain biking or just urban riding. In this review, we're going to be looking at four variations of the Lizard Skin Handlebar grips. We have the Machine, the Auri V2, the Charger Evo, and the Strata. All of them have very similar packaging, just a plastic holder. The grips are right on the inside and there's a little window where you can actually touch and feel the grip to make sure it matches your preference. Installation instructions are printed right on the back. And the basic specs such as length, weight, diameter are printed on there. We'll go ahead and take one out of the box and go over those specs. Retail price on all of these are $33.99. There's multiple color schemes for each of them so you can really find the one that matches your style. And they even have personalization, which is really cool. You can change the ring color as well as add engraving for about $5 extra. So it's a nice little touch to any bike. They all have anti-vibration designs and they're really known for being uh, very grippy. So you don't lose your grip, whether you're doing technical rides or just going around a sharp corner. They're all made in the USA, which is also very rare to see these days. And they all have a single clamp design. They also have other options with dual clamps if they, that's what you prefer. As far as what comes with them, you just get the actual grips and then the instructions are printed right on the little card. So very simple. Now let's take a look at the weight of the different grips. We have the Charger Evo first. So together they come at 102 grams. The Auri V2, that comes in at 120. The Machine, those come in at 100. And then finally the Strata, that comes in about 116. Now let's go over the fit and finish of the grips. Because they all have the same retail price, you can really pick the one that chooses your personality. Each of them are available in five colors. So you can also find the one that matches your bike. And again, you can change the color of the rings for free. And then for $5, you can add an engraving. So you can really make it personal and match your bike. Now each of them have a little bit of different texture, but very similar diameters. And they're all designed to be very grippy. So you don't lose your position on your hand and to be uh, also dampening. So it gets rid of some of the vibrations on the road. So you have a nice comfortable ride. With the machine, you have a dual density design. So you have one texture here, which are these little kind of raised rectangles, very small, and these go on your palm. And then where your fingers go, you can see you have this other wider design. So really comfortable. And you can see these are actually directional. You can use the end caps to help you determine which is which. So if you position the end caps correctly, you'll see on both of them, the lizard skin will actually be facing forward. So if we do that again, you can see lizard skin forward and then the palm portion is the smaller textured section. The Charger Evo is a very interesting design. It's described as their most technical grips to date and it has a very cool texture to it. You can see each of them is slightly raised and it gives this three dimensional structure to it. And when you grip it, it actually collapses a little bit. So really nice design. And again, super grippy. You're definitely not going to lose your handhold here. And again, it has a dual design where the finger section has this more straight and flat section while the palm is super grippy. So a nice combination. And again, the end caps have the lizard, both just different designs. These are all the single clamp. They also have dual clamp available as well with the different models. Auri V2 is printed directly on there, so pretty easy to see. And you can use, again, the end caps to help orientate it. This one has these large rectangular pads. So really designed to dampen the ride and it doesn't have as much of a micro texture as the other ones. So it feels a lot like a bat. It's like a baseball bat, but super grippy. And then very simple design that'll look good on any bike. The Strata is also one of their new models, which combines a lot of the elements of the micro textures, but uses the circular pattern and really mesmerizing design. So you can see the circles actually cut into each other. You have the lizard on the edges. 
So if we orientate these correctly again, you can see where your hands lie, you have a nice medium thickness, but very soft feel, while something like the Aori feels a little bit thicker and larger. So again, you really want to just try them out if you can in a store and choose the one that best fits you. Here you can see a little bit of footage of the grips on the bike. We actually upgraded our 11 fitness bike, which came with some really cheap grips. So these were a huge upgrade. The rubber is a lot softer and has a nice anti-slip and dampening effect. So even on rough roads, you get a lot smoother of a ride. We also really appreciate all the patterns. So we put on a couple different bikes and you can find the different colors or designs that match that bike's personality. So maybe for an urban bike, you want the Charger Evo. Well, for a mountain bike, you want the Auri, so you can really pick and choose. So really no negatives, installing them is a breeze as well. You simply remove your previous ones, which either are just friction fit or undo the clamp. Once it's on, they're really secure, and they're also very easy to clean with the rubber designs. Now let's go over the pros and cons for the Lizard Skin Handlebar Grips. What we like about them is that they have very intricate patterns, so really well designed and highly detailed. They also have anti-slip and high quality soft rubber that's a big upgrade from your stock grips. Also there's a variety of grip patterns and colors so you can really match the grips to your bike or personality. For these grips we don't really have a negative, they're really nicely designed and tons of options to choose from. Taking everything into account would give the grips a 9.7 out of 10. They have a nice intricate and comfortable pattern and a variety of customizations available. Thanks for watching this review, don't forget to like and subscribe. You can see more content from us on our website at thesweetcyclist.com as well as follow us on Instagram at thesweetcyclist. This is The Sweet Cyclist reminding you to enjoy the ride.